yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, coming in, yeah, flex. I just wanna win, yeah. L.A. BB, who we running with, yeah. Two, two, three, three. I'm on ten again, yeah. State your name. What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to another video. I hope everybody out there is having a blessed day. Also, shout out to anybody that is new to the channel. And while you are here, be sure to click on that subscribe button down below. Happy Air Max Day to all of my Air Max heads out there. You know, this is the day that we get to wear, you know, some of our favorite Air Max. And this month, I have worn Air Max every single day up until today. I'm probably just going to, you know, finish it out. It's a couple more days left in March. But, yeah, this is the first time that I've done this. And even though I love Air Max, I'm kind of ready to, you know, go back to wearing other shoes. Um, but I'm definitely glad that I was able to take a W on the Air Max that came out today. Now, there was three different Air Max that came out. There was an all-white pair that released in Europe, and that was a European exclusive. It was called, like, the A, A La Mavor. I'm probably pronouncing it wrong. It was something like that. Those released only in Europe. And then there was another pair that released in Asia and Latin America. That is the Wabi Sabi pair, which to me is the best out of all three that dropped. Um, I'm trying to get those, but prices are kind of crazy. So hopefully the prices do drop on those. And then last but not least, we got the Blueprint pair. So these did drop here at the local sneaker boutique called Feature. Shout out to Feature. Um, they had a whole little event going on. And uh, I kind of wish that I, you know, slowed down and just kind of got a little bit of B-roll to show you guys the event. Nice little event. Also, they did have the concept heavy there, but they did let you get one pair per person. So I definitely went ahead and grabbed these since I didn't have them already. Uh, retail on these is $160. And for anybody who was wondering about the size, go ahead and get your true size. These do run through the size. Um, but if you are going for the other two Air Max from Europe and Asia, those are women's shoes, so you do have to do the size conversion. But other than that, these are true to size, so get your true size. And let's go ahead and take a look. Here we have the Air Max 1 Blueprint. Now, these did drop this morning on sneakers. I was slacking. I slept through the release. I literally woke up maybe like... Five, 10 minutes after the draw closed. If you live in Vegas, you know like nobody would expect Feature to drop them. But yo, shout out to Feature. But yeah, man, this shoe does have nice little details to it. Starting with the back, you do get your Nike ear on the heel. And underneath that, you do have a little globe underneath the logo. And you have some nice suede material right here. All along the shoe, up around the mud guard. Got mesh on the toe cap leather on the mid panels and then you got your two little swooshes this is like a blue textured swoosh right there and then on the inside of the shoe you do have a see-through swoosh so one thing that i think a lot of people don't even know about is the fact that the bottom of this sole glows in the dark and then also this air unit so that's kind of a hidden feature that didn't really get pointed out until closer to the release here we have the insole so you have basically a blueprint pun intended of the air max broken down in different layers glad that i was able to grab these especially for retail i did have a homie that was going to look out for me shout out to my boy shay but i was able to grab these locally um you know from my boutique these do come with the extra pair of white laces not sure which laces I will go with, but we'll see once, you know, I get to the point of wearing them. Resale price is actually not that bad. I want to say these are around like $230, $240, and I'm pretty sure prices will dip just a little bit once people start getting their pairs in from online. So just be patient if you missed out. Usually Air Max, the hype on them kind of dies quick, as you can see with the concept Air Max. So yeah, just be patient if you, you know, missed out on the release. Also, for those of you who did watch my Air Max Concepts Mellow video, I have the heavy pair secured. And then also I did hit on the Concepts Far Out colorway this morning on Concepts. Uh, it's supposed to come with a special box and all that. So be on the lookout for that. We'll have the video with all three shoes. We're going to do a, a, a live unboxing and um, compare and contrast. And uh, talk about which one is the favorite out of the pack, which one was the best. But anyways, that about does it for the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Drop a comment down below. Let me know, like I said, were these a cop, were these a pass? Also, while you're in the comments, let me know which one out of the two that you would pick. I literally just thought about this when I finished the video. But yeah, I just wanted to throw this in here. Let me know out of the two if you had to choose between the blueprints and the pad up. 
Aqua Air Max, which one would you pick? With that said, I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace.